Hello everyone, welcome back to Janice S's channel. If this is your first time, my name is Janice and today I will be demonstrating on how to clean these really juicy pomegranates. And in the previous video that I have posted, I showed you guys how to juice pomegranate juice. So today I will be demonstrating an easy and a faster way of cleaning the pomegranates. Okay, the first thing before you start getting all the pomegranates ready, you will need a special kind of apron or a shirt that you don't really care that if in case it gets juices on it, that's fine. So this will be my apron today and I will be cleaning and taking all the seeds out of those pomegranates. Now these pomegranates came from my tree in my backyard and I have so many um, that I've been making a lot of things with them. So today I will be using pomegranates. I'll be using a spoon, a knife, and a spoon, a plastic spoon. And I will also be using a little cup to pour all my seeds in here once I have them all cleaned out. Okay, so the trick to this is to prevent getting the pomegranate juice on yourself or anywhere in the kitchen because these juices, when once you start cutting them, they start going every which way. So to avoid that, I will show you a different way to how to clean them. Okay, so first off is to cut off the top piece of the pomegranate and also the bottom piece. Okay, once you have that done, as you can see, I did the top and then the bottom piece, and then I will cut the pomegranate in half. Okay, so there are the pomegranates. They're cut in half. And then the next thing that I will be doing would be to remove the seeds from the pomegranate here. So before you do that, I will start to separate the seeds a little at a time. And that's basically to loosen them up a little bit. And then with your spoon, a uh, metal spoon you can use, and you can start hitting the top part of the pomegranate, just like this. As you can see, all the seeds are starting to get loose and then they start coming apart. Okay, so the trick here is to make sure you hit with a plastic spoon or a metal spoon to loosen up all the seeds in there. And as you can see, the seeds are starting to come out. Sometimes when you see like it's getting a little bit difficult to uh, release all the seeds, just loosen them up a little bit and then you can see how they started to come out. And there's other methods that you can clean the pomegranates. Um, you can either split them in fours or you can just um, loosen them up like I did in the beginning. And then after, when all the seeds are getting loose, and then it's a lot easier to transfer them onto a plate. And that prevents from getting yourself all dirty with the juice, because once the juice gets on your clothes, it's pretty hard to remove. It's just like drinking grape juice. And I don't know if you ever experienced uh, spilling grape juice on yourself. It just literally stains your clothes and I found this method a lot better by using a spoon. And basically you just do the same thing for the rest of the pomegranates. Remove all the seeds. And there's different ways that you can eat pomegranates. 
you can make it into a juice or you can eat it by itself of course don't eat the seeds you just um, take the juice out of the pod the seeds the pomegranate seeds and these pomegranates are really healthy for you I mean it's really good for your health has a lot of vitamins it helps with your immune system and there's a lot of good benefits on eating pomegranates so this is so simple once you get the hang of it on how to clean them and I do a lot of pomegranates every single day um, just to have them as a fruit or for a side dish after you have a heavy dinner and you want something light and this is the best way to have your fruit and it's really good it's great tasting and I'm sure everybody would like this so let's go on to the next step okay now all the pomegranate seeds are all taken out from the pomegranate here so now I will transfer the seeds into my little bowl here and this pomegranate that I cut up today is really ripe and you can tell when they're ripe by the color of the seeds the darker the seeds the juicier they are and also when um, they're ripe on the tree you can tell that when they're ripe as well because they come off really easy from the stem and those are the best ones to have because they're really juicy and they're really good for you and they're healthy and normally what I do is after I get all my seeds in my little bowl or in a plate um, I normally put them in the refrigerator for a couple of hours until it's time to have dinner or basically for a snack and they come out really nice and cold and like I said before you can eat them like this and also you can juice them you can put these little seeds into a blender and then with a little bit of water and mix it all up and you have your pomegranate juice uh, for breakfast or for lunch or for dinner and well I hope this video was very helpful and I hope you take the opportunity to learn how to remove the seeds from the pomegranate it's it's really easy to to do you just need a spoon or a plastic spoon and it's basically easy to make so thanks for watching today and please watch my other videos um, I have a lot of great videos there and so if you if you are interested in any of my videos please leave me a comment leave me some ideas on um, what you would like me to make for my next video and i'll be seeing you guys very soon for more videos okay take care bye